Hi everyone, I'm just coming here today with a haul for you. It's a multi haul from several different places and people. So first off we have Tweety Mail from Alma Tweety for March. Full nice 3D brush, metal hearts, and you can also bend these to the curve of your nail so you know that. I have spikes, spangles with a little clover, holographic glitter, fingernail clippers, this cute girl, and purple glitter. This eyeshadow that I bought at Rite Aid. Um, it was seven dollars and I made a beautiful color. I just, you know, it seems like oranges just don't show up very well on the camera, but it is the same orange that I used in these nails here. It is beautiful and it also makes some beautiful 3D roses too. Okay, I was in Family Dollar and they had a new display set up of Wet n Wild Make a Last nail polishes. This is a beautiful mint color called Retro Mint. This is a beautiful neon orange called Sunspot. A nice neutral called Private Viewing. They have such a nice display set up in there now. Okay, this is from Cosmoprof. You need a license to shop here. This is C&D's Retention Powder. It's in clear and it was $11. I do like to use this clear on my nail beds before applying any kind of a glitter or a colored acrylic to my nail beds. Um, and this retention is for anybody that may have problems with lifting or just to, it's just made for um, better adhesion. So here we have Hobby Lobby. Okay, these are brads. Um, they have the piece of wire in the back that you can just cut that off. I thought these were gorgeous to go on nails. And they're already kind of decorated around right there. I thought they would be beautiful on a nail. I love that color of blue too. And this was, um, I think it was half off because it was Easter. And these are little daisy stickers. You can cut them and put them on your nails. Cut them right there. And I got gemstones. These were half off, so I think they were $2. Look at these. These are matte, kind of matte looking. This one looks like it's a blue jean color. And it has brown and orange. They're just gorgeous. I love them. Um, just uh, like a cream colored stone, browns grays and this blue here is beautiful it's a turquoise blue Just at hobby lobby i did pick up another one of these velvet glitter sample packs too went in there for and used my 40 percent off coupon was these embossing powders so i ended up getting them for like 7.98 but i love these these are great to add to mixes they're great to just do 3d with and I love them. I'm really getting into them. So I think they are beautiful. I got some more of these little confettis. They're so pretty. I love that green in there. I got some more of these gems here. And these are the same gems that I'm wearing on my finger right here. I had a few people ask me. And there they are. Okay, these were in the dollar bin at Michael's. All these. These are a very pretty pastel green that I kind of love that color. Kind of like on the mint side. Same with these pretty jewels. These are silver. Oh, and I love these. Little half pearls. And some more of the green. These are a darker green. Two shades of green there. Those were, like I said, a dollar a piece. I got some of the small packs of velvet glitter, which it's um, matte glitter. Very pretty. It's what I used in the um, sand glass video that I did. Some of these gorgeous stickers. Look at that. Aren't they gorgeous? 
I love them. Beautiful. Paper tape. Beautiful mint color, too. Three packages of these cute owl cards. Just when I send out swaps. Little things. They're cute. Okay, and these stones here were in the dollar bin, too, at Michael's. Very pretty pinks. And now we have eBay, and I bought this pigment on eBay, and I paid $3.95 for it. Okay, and this is what I got from eBay. I got 60 of these pigments for, I believe it was like $11 and something. I mean, so the, for the price, $11 and something, um, you know, I really can't complain. I, I got a lot of, um, you know, different colored pigments. I separated them and I tried to keep the pigments over in this area on this side. So I got quite a few um, colors of different pigments to to make um, some colored acrylics with. There's a really pretty one too. I love that one. So and then of course you know I have a lot of glitter and they gave me 30 glitters too which I mean, I would have liked to have had less glitters. For the price, you know, you know, Pearl X pigments are pretty expensive. I have a set of those, a series two, and they were like $25. So, I mean, I'm not gonna even use all this pigment to make one color. That's a pretty green too. I love it. That's a beautiful green. But I mean, you're not gonna use all this in one mix. So I'll have a lot left over. Okay, so anyways, I just want to say thanks for watching my haul, and we will talk to you soon. Thanks. Bye.